hello my wonderful people welcome back to my youtube channel if this is your first time coming across any video on this channel i want to encourage you to get ready the subscribe button and also turn on notification bell icon so when next we are putting new video on this channel you'll be among the four set of people to get the notification so right now i'm right there Simon Iqba orders Bria France to do to do this immediately to Igbo women who threaten to poison Edo and Yoruba people. So this um, particular update is going to clarify your doubts and make you know that Simon Iqba is actually a freedom fighter and I don't think he has any harm to he, he has any mind to harm anybody in Nigeria. His main objective is just to see that the Biafra nation actually stand in peace. Understand so, and you know, earlier this year, Samonic by actually announced it that the Piafran um, nation is going to stand on the December 2nd, 2024. And we have been looking because we want to see the reaction of the Nigerian government and the Nigerian authorities toward his actions. You understand? So, Samonic by the prime minister of Biafra has issued a directive to the Biafra com um, community regarding Amaka. The Igbo woman who sparked outrage with a threat to poison Yoruba and Edo people. Simon Igbo has ordered Bria France to do to immediately contact you know Son Baga and encourage her to reach out to the Bria France Lyson Lyson in Canada or uh, or him himself directly. And so Simon Igbo a directive Simon Igbo's directive made on his verified social media and to emphasize the need for um Sonberger to contact the Biafran government without any delay. So he assured her that she has nothing to fear and urged Biafran to tag her, stressing that her contact information is urgently needed. The Biafran government under Samonic Bas leadership has pledged to defend Sonberger against any action taken by Nigerian government, which Simon Iqba refers to as a terrorist state. This move has raised questions about the Biafran government's you know, state stance on hate speech and violence. However, why some have praised Simon Iqba's move as a, as a show of solidarity with Sonberger, others have, have criticized it as you know, an endorsement of her actions. This Niger the Nigerian government has yet to respond to Simon Iqbal's statement, but it's, it is still clear. Um, it is clear that you know the situation is escalating; that it is you know is going beyond people's expectation. So, as tension rises, Simon Iqbal's directive has added a new layer of complexity to an already you know a already vital um, situation. Will his move lead um, to further conflict? Or can it be a step forward resolving the crisis? What I could um, I ask this question, but for me, I'll give my own answer is because only time can tell. So give your own answer also in the comment section and let's see how you truly understand you know what we are actually saying on this particular video. So the Biafran community is urged to take immediate action in contacting Son Braga and encouraging her to reach out to the Biafran government. The situation is being closely monitored and developments will be reported as more information become available. In summary, Biafran's Prime Minister has ordered Biafran to contact Amaka Son Braga who threatened to poison Yoruba people and Edo people and assure her of protection against Nigerian government's action sparking controversies you know and raising questions about Biafran's stance on aid speech so this is what Samonic Ba posted on his verified twitter and he said the Biafran government will defend Amaka against any action taken by the Nigerian terrorist state we equally call on Amaka to immediately contact the Biafran liaison in Canada or anywhere with a contact with her contact should contact the Biafran government or myself directly. Tag Amaka, we need a contact immediately. She must not panic for any any reason. Because this is what Samonikwa actually posted on his verified Twitter page. So right now, right there, I want you guys to go to the comment section and share your opinion concerning what you think. Do you think what's the action Samonikwa actually took is right or wrong? So go to the comment section and share your opinion in the comment section. So 
we can know how to reply you you know and how to have more conversation with you have a great day ahead bye